In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to add images to your apps built using MIT App Inventor 2. So I've opened up a new program here. The first thing you'll need to do is to get your image onto your computer. So either download an image that you're free to use off of Google Images or another website, or if it's an image that you took, make sure you've gotten that onto your computer. The most obvious way to use images is using this image component from the user interface. So we can drag that and drop it onto the screen. We need to tell it exactly what image we want to put on the screen. So to do that, we can go under the properties, and then where it says picture, we need to click on none, and then upload file. Then click choose file. Now you need to navigate to whichever directory has your picture in it. I have this kitten image that I want to use. So I will click on that and then click open. Now click OK. It uploads and then the kitten appears on your app. Even though it looks like only part of the image has appeared on my screen, if you try it out on a phone, uh, in my case it actually does show this whole image. So you'll want to try it out on a device first to see how this actually appears. But if you'd like to adjust the sizing, you can go under where it says height and width. You can change these to either fill parent, which means just stretch across the entire screen, or you can adjust it by pixels or percent. So for example, if I want to make it smaller, I can maybe do 40 pixels for the height, and then I'll just also do 40 pixels for the width. And now I have a much smaller image on my screen. If you want your image to take up the entire background of your screen, there's an easier way to do this. So I'm just gonna delete my image component here to show you. To do that, we can actually just go under the screen one components and where it says background image, we can change that to this kitten. And notice that we don't have to upload it again because it already has it in its system. So I will click on kitten.jpg and then click OK. And now it's appeared on the screen. You can't adjust anything about the sizing of this because since it's on the screen, it assumes that you want it to take up the entire screen. One additional way we can use images is through buttons. And so I'm going to turn this back to none for now to show you how that works. Now I'll drag a button onto the screen. And you'll see that this one also has an image property. So I can click on this and change it to kitten.jpg and click OK. And now my kitten appears. For me, this takes up my entire screen. So again, if I want to make the button smaller, I can change my height and width. So there you go, that's how to use images in App Inventor.